in the first part of this, whenever you're welding cast iron, the one thing you can't have is any false guides or seats in the heads, okay? Meaning, if there's false seats or guides in there, they have to be removed. The reason for this is because the heat will temper it in such a way that it will cause it to lose its crush and fall out. So let's go in here and let's uh, take one of the seats out of the head and show you how I get that done. And then just clean it up with a wire brush and get it ready to start welding. It's pretty much that straightforward on this. So all I'm using is a little cylinder. And if you go over into the iron a little bit, it really don't matter because we're not putting new seats in the head. We're actually going to weld the seats in. pretty close that's usually when I'll try to beat it out the rest of the way I don't want to go dig no trenches if I don't have to okay let's give her a go here and see what we got now it looks like we gotta have just a a little bit more, not much. It don't take much. Once it loses its elasticity, that's it. to roll it over here it's hard for me to get it at this angle I'm trying to get you some film on it let me turn it around another way right, once I barely got it to move which I just I just ground a touch it just takes that little bit now look how easy she'll pop out well huh. all right and that's it now I gotta get the rest of them out and see it didn't leave too bad of an invention if you look Because remember, I'm going to go in there and weld that whole seat back up. Okay, let's look at the one right here that's got the hole in it. Yeah, wow. That's a pretty brutal deal right there. Alright, I'm going to go ahead and pop all the rest of these seats out. And then we're going to prep it and get it ready to throw her in the oven and set the torch up. Now once all the seats are out, you're going to go in here with your wild bag.
sure that a good weld is a clean weld. Okay? And of course, there's our old seat. So now we know we got that out of the way. And there is no false guides. These are the original guides in the heads. We don't have a thing to worry about now. When the weld comes in there, it'll lay right in like butter. All right, I'm going to finish wire brushing them, and we're going to lay the torch out put them in the oven. The oven we're going to use to kick it up, I can usually get around 700 degrees in here. I believe I've actually got pretty close to 800. We'll start on this end one here first. You can see the big hole in it. Right there, we're going to build up and then start building up some on the seat. So let's go ahead now and get this thing a cooking.